You know, it takes a special person to be a zookeeper, especially if you're dealing with certain critters. Well, I went to the Greensboro Science Center to be a part of their Echo Explorer program, which allows you to be somewhat of a zookeeper for a day. But on this day, it was something special. Take a look. All right, you can, you can sit that down. <laughs> All right, there it is. My love-hate relationship. I, I, I am absolutely fascinated with spiders, but I'm also scared to death. Kelsey's here to talk about. This is part of the Eco Explorer program, yes. right? What is that? So Eco Explorer is a citizen science program that we partner with. Um, so it's to get kids that are K through eight out in nature, engaging with whatever they can find, from birds to plants to mammals. And this year, we're actually starting a new badge called the Arachnology Badge. So we're going to talk all about spiders all through September and October. So it's going to be a lot of fun, a lot of new information for us as well, learning about all of those native spiders. Um, this not native, right? This, this is one Mexican, is not native, yep. a Mexican red knee tarantula. Her name is Rosa. Um, so she just lives here at the Science Center, um, living I love her best life. What you told me, right? Well, she has the perfect life. She doesn't yes. Do. Um, tell me about how they defend themselves. Because this so, is yes, neat. it's one of my favorite things to talk about with this particular species and other species as well. But they do have all of those little hairs, particularly back on their um, abdomen there, and that is a defense mechanism that they can kick off those hairs and they're very, very itchy. Um, and that's actually what itching powder was originally made out of. So whenever wow. something's trying to attack them, they can kick those off. It creates an irritation and I wouldn't want to be tangled with anything yeah. that's causing me to be itchy, so I would also let it go. So they get airborne and then just attach to your yep. skin. Yep, just attaches to All right, so yep. when I saw this, I thought you had one live, and I'm like, no. no. So I've got a couple molts here. So spiders um, have an exoskeleton, so when they grow, they can't just grow. It doesn't grow with them like it does for us. So they actually have to molt that exoskeleton. So here I have one of Rosa's. Um, oh my gosh. So you can see here the eight legs. So. All spiders have eight yes. legs. They have two body segments. Um, so this top one here and then what's left of the um, abdomen there. Um, and when they actually molt off, they do it upside down. That looks so real. And even the fangs molt off. So they would pop their, the center part of their body mm -hmm. comes out and then they just pull their yep, legs out. Yep, they do it the from rest. the back out. Then this is something out. that you would learn about in the Eco Explorer. Yes, probably, yep. This is one badge that I, <laughs> I want you to give me the badge just because yep. I got that close to that. Yep. Thing. Yep. All right. Thank you very much for your no time. No problem. I think my skin is growing. Do you up. see my hair standing up? It is. It's I, happening. I, uh -huh. I do have a love hate thing with them. Oh, I do see. You it. see? Yeah. Oh, I do because I, I'm fascinated. I watch everything I can about spiders. I think they're cool, but I cannot stand <laughs> them at the cool. same time. Yeah. But the way they molt, like I don't, uh -huh. and I was saying this during the story, they flip over on their backs and then somehow they get out of that and leave it all intact. It's just so crazy. weird. When we went to Costa Rica, we actually yeah. took a <laughs> tour at night of the jungle. Oh, no. Uh huh, of the state park and saw a tarantula in its live element and walked right next to it. And it really doesn't want to like jump on you yeah, or yeah, anything yeah. like that. But it is a big spider. It Was is it a like big your hand? spider. Is it that big? At least the size really? of your hand, yes. Mm. Have you ever seen those trapdoor spiders? They build, they dig a hole in the ground. This is in desert climates, I think. Uh -huh. They dig a hole, I know far too much about spiders. They dig a hole and then they do a web with dirt in it so it looks like the ground. Oh, so that it, something calls, crawls into it. They, well, when it, got, when it comes by, it's lurking uh -huh. and then it pops up, grabs it, takes it down and the, and the door shuts. Mm. I mean, it's insane. Well, I mean, we all gotta eat. I'm really trying to fix my face. I don't want to look. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, Cindy, you're on TV. Smile, you can't have do the something, but face. I truly cannot. That's okay. So we you can't need to do this face. this Echo Explorer program with the I know she, she does not. not. <laughs> she does but not. I just want a video. You don't have to do all the things, people. You just don't. see. You see, he just wants a video. I want a video. <laughs>